On April 22, 2025, QJ Motor released the new 2025 version of OAO, priced at 16,999 renminbi, or $2,300. This is right. Let's take a look with me below. The appearance of QJ OAO is very similar to its other imitation racing bikes, with a streamlined body, a high-tech front face, and a very aggressive style. At a glance, you can tell that it is from the same family as the racing series. However, the most eye-catching point is the floating seat. Because it is an electric bike, the original fuel tank is a storage space that can accommodate a full face helmet, which is both practical and beautiful. Now many electric motorcycles, including BMW CE, basically adopt this hollow storage design, which can be regarded as a trend. After talking about the appearance, let's take a look at the performance. OAO uses a 10 kilowatts or 13.41 horsepower mid-mounted motor and has a top speed of 105 kilometers per hour. It is indeed incomparable with gasoline vehicles in terms of top speed, but OAO is strong and low torque. As long as you dare to twist it, it will dare to twist. The maximum torque is 650 newton meters. Maybe you don't have any idea about it. The maximum torque of Torque Master MT-09 is 93 newton meters. Of course, this is the general performance of electric vehicles. It is equipped with a 72V60 AUS softpack lithium battery. The official range is 200 kilometers, and the actual driving range is only about 120 kilometers. It can only be said that it is enough. It takes about 3.5 hours to fully charge 80%. I don't know if there is any possibility of subsequent modifications to improve the range. Please tell me my motorcycle friends. In addition, OAO supports remote monitoring and OTA upgrades. Although it has four speeds, there is no need to squeeze the clutch. The bike weighs only 144 kilograms and the seat height of 780 millimeters is also very friendly. How can I say it? Apart from the weak acceleration in the rear section, the power in the front section can still surpass that of a gasoline-powered bike, and the handling is still okay. To sum up, OAO is suitable for those environmentalists who want a racing-style appearance, don't like shifting gears, and don't like the smell of gasoline, and can accept short battery life and low speed, and only require acceleration in the front part.